Yo, what's going on, guys? Shake and bake back. And yeah, high voltage packs are out. They're pretty dope. I'm not gonna lie. These are the coolest cards in the game, look wise. But my pack odds stunk for the first box opening I did. Uh, I opened about 550 KVC. Did not really get anything. I did get a couple of amethysts, so I guess that's okay. But I don't know. For the most part, I wasn't satisfied. Like, I literally didn't even pull one of the emeralds. I didn't pull any of the rubies. I don't know. I just felt like I wasn't getting that many players. I, I did pull, you know, what, seven guys? But out of, like, 50 or 60 packs, that's definitely not that crazy, man. So I don't know. Uh, I've waited a little bit. I'm hoping the pack odds are a little better. I opened them when they first came out. And I think that's usually a bad idea. Uh, but there's a freaking Brandon Roy in these packs. It is literally the coolest looking card in my team history. I'm not gonna lie. That's that's just pure facts. Look at this card, bro. With the lightning going up. Yesterday, I tweeted out that, like, someone tweeted me this. And, I, like, the lightning effect. And I was like, I've never seen that. That has to be something that has to do with tomorrow's promo. And people are like, I've seen that before in game. I have never seen that, I, as I said. And I, I thought this was gonna be part of the effect look at the lightning on the side too like the side of the card has like thunder and lightning bro that's so cool oh my goodness and then they even have like a voltage on them in here so crazy stuff um brendan roy's impacts man and uh first time ever in my team they also have jermaine o'neal and mose malone is a set reward this is a juicy set crazy nice stats he can shoot he can drive he's got ball handling he has speed um the only thing he doesn't have is hall of fame badges i guess but uh, crazy nice card man 94 overall brandon roy and then again there is also a jermaine o'neal which is pretty damn good too um so this is a good set to complete i would like to definitely complete this just because it's got brandon roy and i want to have him and if you already have him you might as well complete the set but if your packs are trash like my first packs were you ain't gonna get no you ain't gonna complete it um and i also don't have any freaking mt so <laughs> Uh, I, I didn't pull, like, any duplicates either, really. Like, I, I think I pulled, like, a one. I have, like, a Kevin Durant Amethyst. But, like, so I didn't get good pack on I got mostly current players from them. I got three duplicates. So we got ten total voltage players out of probably 50 to 60 packs. That's definitely not good odds, right? Come on, man. Uh, hoping they're a little bit better. We will see. We're going to pull some packs right now, man. But... I had to calm down a little bit. If my packs are trash this time around, they just trash. I don't know what else to say. Uh, that's, I guess, how it goes. One week out for these packs. I still think the heat check packs are the best packs value-wise. Like, there's even a, uh, what's it called? There's even a uh, freaking um, uh, Steph Curry and Blake Griffin. And those moments cards are also in these High voltage batch, which I like. So I think these are pretty decent, um, but they're still really expensive. And I don't know, first time around, I pulled more bronze players than I did actual players from the set. And that's not good. That's definitely disappointing. And I, I don't want to do a video complaining, but like, yeah, so that's what that was. So that's why I'm redoing it. I'm reopening more, giving these a second chance. And this is definitely my last chance. If these are, if these are not good, uh, I'm definitely not hitting it back for a third time here. I already think $200 is way too much for some packs but uh hey man brandon roy is in them i do really want the card I, I man i've been clamoring for him to be in my team for literally years now years i've been saying brandon roy needs to be in my team uh all righty do we okay no we're still getting league players <laughs> these are still looking like league packs <laughs> okay this is uh definitely not what i was expecting ruby player please be someone from the set Fam, thank you. Finally, Sam Cassell. We actually get a ruby from this set. That is my first one again. I pulled multiple, multiple packs and did not get any from the set. So now, at least we're actually pulling, you know, high voltage players. Larry Hughes right there. Which is what I want to see, man. I want to see the new cards. I don't want to see the league packs, you know what I mean? If I want league packs, I'll pull those bad boys. But hopefully we can pull a diamond out of two boxes. I did pull some singles too. Like, I pulled singles. I pulled boxes. I was pulling everything and... I was not having the good luck. We are getting some silvers, which I guess I could sell in the auction house and probably make a good little profit, which is eh, not too bad, but I, I want, you know, I want Brandon Roy. <laughs> come on, man. We still got a topper, too. These do come with a topper. My first topper was, I think, Sapphire, like Karan Butler or someone else. Um, but we still have that topper chilling around in this box, too. Maybe we get some topper luck. I feel like the toppers are usually not that crazy, though. Um, come on, man. I'm <laughs> windowing down in this box. And I don't see no diamond, bro. I need something. Oh. Thank you! Finally! Dog, we got a diamond. If this is Brandon Roy, I'm going nuts. Who is it? Show me Brandon. Ah, oh, it's Jermaine O'Neal. That's okay, man. That's dope still. We do get a diamond player. Finally, man. 
Again, I ripped a whole lot of these packs before and didn't get anything. So that's kind of nice to see, man. We do not get Brandon Roy, but we do at least get Jermaine O'Neal. So now, if I do really want, I suppose I could sell him and pick up Brandon Roy if we don't pull anything else. And, like, I'm not going to do the set, but I, I want to do the set too. Dang, man. There's, that Moses Malone is crazy too. It's Loki his return. I don't think he was in the game last year. He did pass, and uh, I guess they still have his rights, or they picked them back up. I'm not too sure. I know he's in NBA Live as well, I think. Um, we still have our topper, too. Yo, imagine if we got a diamond topper. That would be crazy. But these packs definitely seem and feel better than they were earlier today, where, again, I just didn't even... I wasn't even getting, like, the Sapphire ones. I was getting a lot of current players. Um, last pack is our topper. At the end, we do get a ruby, which... Oh, man, no, that's actually better than the Sapphire I got last time. Gary Payton. So we got one more box... If we could clutch it with back-to-back -back diamonds, man, that would be great. I'm literally just sending uh, a couple of these guys, and, I mean, the sapphires don't really sell for much. I guess the silvers do. I can still send the silvers. Do not quick sell the silvers. That would have been an L. That was definitely better. Again, we did pull an actual diamond this time. Uh, first time around, we did manage to pull one decent card, but and now I feel like we almost have the set done, which is kind of nice, but obviously we need this card, and this card goes for a grip. This is probably going to be... Selling for 300, 400k. Right now, I just don't have MT, man. I sold... I, I did a lot of heat check sets. I, again, I, I told you I've been working on that token grind. I still need to get you a couple of videos. My internet's still down, though, so I'm struggling. It's tough, man. Life is tough right now. It's a little bit harder. I'm, I'm first world problems, I guess. I don't know. <laughs> but we only need three players from this set. If we can manage to pull Brandon Roy in this last box... This is definitely the last box I'm doing, by the way. Unless we pull, like, seven diamonds, then I'll pull another one. Why not? <laughs> Uh, but, but yeah, last box, man. This will literally take pretty much all of our VC. We did have a good 20 box there. That was pretty solid. We did pull a diamond. If we pull another diamond in here, I would be really actually pretty pleased. Um, or even just some of the rubies or players from the set. Gary Payton right there. Like, as long as we're pulling players from the set in these packs, I'm pretty happy and pretty hyped. But yeah, as I said, this is what I pulled the first time around. Derek White and Abdar Dakari Johnson, bro. I pulled like 10 of him. So, hopefully, this doesn't become one of them boxes. Come on, man. Show me the diamond glow one more time. Come on, man. Make it a nice little pack opening, man. If we pull balls, it would not be crazy nice, man. I'm not going to lie. That ain't it, though. Sapphire Topper, 6 out of 21. So, now we're just relying on the packs for the rest of the way. To show me a diamond glow, I actually pulled two diamond contracts early, man. Hey, Shaq. There we go. Ruby Shaq. So, literally, we only need one card now, I think, from this set. And it's freaking Brandon Roy, of course, man. He's going to go for so much, too. He's going to be expensive. He is definitely not going to be a cheap card. Um, so if I don't pull him in these next 10 packs, I'm probably... Ah, man, I'm going to have to sell off heat check players or something, man. I don't even know. I have no freaking MD right now. I don't have any. I got, like, 50K. That's not going to be enough to get it done and to get him. Obviously, I'll sell off the duplicates and stuff like that. But um, I'm not really making a ton of MT on the auction house, but... This might make us some profit right here as we get an Amethyst pull, hoping it's player from the set, because they do go for considerably more. It is. That's going to be Rod Strickland. Nice, man. My packs just seem so much better right now, so maybe the odds were not that great when I first pulled in the beginning. Maybe that's on me. That's a new move. I should have waited. Rod Strickland. Oh, that's cool. Bro, that was sick. He hit the card. That's like the card was flying away. That was actually really dope. But yeah, I'm also really close to getting that 100k MT bonus. I mean, not really close. I still need like 50 or 60 cards, maybe maybe a little bit more than that. So I'm not really close to that, but we are inching towards that. But overall, these boxes felt a little bit better than the last couple. That's why I was like, man, let me redo this. Let me wait a little bit. Let me see if the pack odds get any better. And they definitely did, I feel like. Man, I'll say, yeah, I think they did. I don't know. Again, it changes so frequently, man. It is crazy. Four packs left, though. Steve Kerr right there. Can we get insanely lucky and clutch it in the last few? Probably not, man. Uh, probably going to be GG'd, and the only card we didn't get was Brandon. No, don't tell me. Just just open it. Just open it, please. No, no, no. Don't do this. Don't do this. Don't do this. Don't do this. Ah, oh, it's Jermaine O'Neal. No. <laughs> That's all right, man. That's actually dope because now we will have to wait for it to sell, but I think I could probably maybe get Brandon Roy now. That's dope, man. Thank goodness. Wow. I cannot believe we just clutched it out and pulled a diamond again, bro. That's crazy. See, the packs seem much better now than what they were earlier. I don't know, man. Earlier, I felt like I was getting screwed. So we do get a second time, but it's not Roy. Ah, I really wanted Brandon Roy, bro, and I still do. He is literally, I think, the only card I don't have. 
I might not have one of the emeralds too, but uh, wow. See, look at this. Look at all the heat check players. I mean, that heat check, whatever they are. Uh, voltage players we got this time. Something's different. So here's what we're at right now. I'm just missing Joe Johnson. I still didn't pull him. And freaking Brandon Roy, of course. And this card is going to be going for a ton, man. I'm, I'm hoping there is a lot of him pulled. And maybe his price comes down to like 150k or something. Probably won't. Uh, it's probably one of the coolest diamonds in the game, man. He's going to be going for so much. And there's really not even like a ton of him up on the auction house right now. Like there's a good amount. But not like a ton. He's not flooded. Um, so I, hopefully I can sell the Jermaine O'Neal. For a good amount, um, I'll definitely, like, I'll post that card up right now. Um, uh, let's see let's see if he's going for under right now, though. So, I'll probably try and pick up this Brandon Roy and finish this set and get Moses Malone. But, um, yeah, man, I'm gonna obviously sell that duplicate Jermaine O'Neal. Would have been crazy clutch if we could have just pulled Brandon Roy and we could have got Jermaine O'Neal now. Of course not. <laughs> the 2K gotta make things hard on me, but it's all good, man. I definitely feel like my pack offs were better this second time around, so I'm glad I... Glad I bought more VC, even though it's pretty expensive, man. $200 for a pack opening is just getting a little ridiculous. Bro, what the heck? Why is there a friggin' ray of beam of light on me, man? What the? Has that been an old pack opening? I don't think it has, man. All right, we better now. <laughs> I got a lightning bolt coming down on me, but the uh, voltage pack's pretty cool, man. I mean, like, bro, this animation, like, it's just crazy. It looks so cool. So I will definitely pick up the Brandon Roy, try and get you guys some gameplay. Uh, I hope my internet's better, man. I don't even think I can play a game. Like, I don't even know if I can play a game online on my freaking Wi-Fi hotspot for my phone. I don't know if that's going to hold up. Probably won't. I mean, I, I'm lucky to even just be pulling packs and playing the game and, like on the leaderboard and like auction house and stuff. Uh, but, yeah. Let's see. Well, I'll try my best, man. I'm going to try. Uh, again, they're here working on shit. and I, I don't know if it's getting done. But, yeah. Hope you guys did enjoy the packs. And, um, yeah. Be sure to leave a like for more videos. Peace, man.